you begged for Muslim representations from the Kof, from the Kofars. I think this is what, what it means. From the Kofs is Kofs the short for Kofars? Kofars? Can somebody, um, Katie? Can can somebody keep keep an eye on? Oh yeah, thank you so much. Queen Fabi is checking. Queen Fabi, let me know in the live chat if 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 it is real, the real Matt. If if he posts something on Twitter, or yeah. Uh, you all back for Muslim representation from the Kufs. Wow, this is, is this really the short for Kofars? By the way, if you guys don't know, Kofars means no, um, non-Muslims. Well, this is now what you're getting. Like, I think this is a common belief that you guys shouldn't want representation among non-Muslims. You guys should just work on the Muslim community and fighting for Islam and making Islam better. Why do you even care that the non-Muslims accept you? Like, you guys, are, you guys be desperate. Like a lot of Muslims think you don't need to be simping for all these non-Muslims asking for representation, asking for acceptance. You have Allah on your side. Why do you need non-Muslims to accept you? You know, this is so. This is a common uh, view as well. <clears throat> um, oh, this is another response. When we were Terry, Terry, yes, this is greater than this. That's what he's saying. Sinan saying. Okay, this is this seems like we have a common theme here. Okay, so given that I can't zoom in, I'm just going to read these. Ramsha is saying, can Hollywood please go back to portraying us Muslims as Terry S? Well, Ramsha, you don't even have a job on. Like a lot of these people that are commenting, they wouldn't even like you the way you present yourself. I don't. Okay, so she continues and saying, I don't feel so sure about inter intersectional progressive Islam. Intersectional progress, progressive is progressive Islam. You mean progressive Muslims uh, is what you are with your lack of hijab. Spook is saying, please just go back. I mean, even if you're not, the fact that you're just displaying a picture of a woman without a hijab on your profile picture that is haram. I know this, I know Muslim more than these people. Um, please just go back to portraying us as terriest. Had enough of this representation nonsense. Amazing. I guess most of them are like this. I urge everyone to respond to this so that they are faced with significant backlash. Us Muslims cannot have our religion disrespected by capitalists wishing to cause us cause controversy. Okay, that was a new take. Let's look at this one. Filthy. Filthy. May Allah punish those fake Muslims who are empowered these disgusting groups and stand with them. Puke emoji, puke emoji, puke emoji. What is this? I'm cute. I'm 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 trying to have an eye on the live chat to see if Fatima is saying anything. Um, I would much rather be represented as an effing terrier than this. You know, I want to be outraged by this um, caption right now, but all I can think of is how cute Sumaya is. If that's a real picture. Sorry, I, I was distracted. Sorry, sorry. Hey, don't shame me for being a straight male. Um, it probably was a troll. Can we just pretend that I was a real Midlanty? Can we just pretend? Let's just pretend. I was because it had a happy ending. Um, Maliki. Is saying Muslims and non Muslims should know that opposing this misrepresentation of Islam and Muslims is not extremism. Wait, what? Muslims and non Muslims should know that opposing this misrepresentation of Islam and Muslims is not extremism. Guys, it's not a okay, it's not a misrepresentation of Muslim, Islam, or mu Muslims. Okay, it's not a misrepresentation of Islam because it's not saying what Islam says, it's showing you the life of, of a few. Aren't Muslims the ones that keep telling us, many Muslims, many Muslims who keep telling us that, li listen, Muslims are flawed, Islam is perfect. So they understand that the lives of Muslims does not necessarily reflect Islam. So they understand that. When Muslims keep telling us that, hey, Islam is perfect, Muslims are not, that's them admitting 
that Muslim lives do not always reflect Islam. So where was this, where in this movie was it shown that, hey, this is, by the way, a completely in accordance with Islam, with the Quran and Hadith. So where's the misrepresentation of Islam happening? There's no misrepresentation of Islam. There are gay Muslims out there, and they have different experiences, and this is, does refer, represent a lot of them. Okay, they do exist. Okay, so there's no misrepresentation of Islam and there's no misrepresentation of Muslims either. These people, these lives are out there. God damn it. Like, how are you saying this is a misrepresentation of Muslims? Are you like, are you like, like, do you have your head in the sand or something? This is no, it's yeah, but I agree. This is what you're, you're, you opposing this. It's not extremism. Okay, you're not going boom, boom or anything like that. So it's not extremism, it's just idiotic, okay? I admit it, none of these comments by these Muslims, none of it is extremist. None of it is, I can't, I can't believe like anybody would call tweets or, you know, butthurt on Twitter extremism. It's not extremism until you go boom, boom, I guess, right? But it is idiotic, it is homophobic, and apparently it's also anti-Semitic. They continues, Maliki continues, you can love or hate what I say. The Quran is very clear on homosexuality. Where in the trailer do you see anything about what the Quran says? Did what did I miss that part? It, yes, the Quran is very clear. I agree. The Quran is very clearly anti-homosexuality. The Quran is the move, but does that mean that gay Muslims do not exist? And that they are, that they, do you think gay Muslims, like all Muslims are completely living their lives according to in accordance to the Quran? I mean, thankfully not. Thank you, at least they're not. We would be screwed if they were. This planet would not survive if they were all following as the Quran, right? So they're not. But the, what are these dumb takes? Why does the why does the world view anal sex as progress? <laughs> And the peak of civilization. <laughs> I mean, they do, the world doesn't, but they should. <laughs> I mean, why not? <laughs> oh my God. These people think, first of all, it's funny how they think being gay is just about anal sex. And it's also funny how they think that straight people don't have anal sex. This is so amazing. This is so amazing. They, they, their understanding of two, like, first, two men being attracted to each other, like, if, if somebody is gay, they think that, they don't understand that the feelings that a, a straight man gets when they look at a woman, a gay man gets when they look at another man. It's not like, Ooh, I really want something up my butt. I really, 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 really wanted something up my butt. That's not, and and it's and it seems like women don't have the equipment to put something up my butt, and other men have something. It's like they, they think that's what it is. They think that the, the, what makes you gay is this urge just to have anal sex. They don't understand that it is but it's a lot more than just that. Oh my god. It's actually it's really easy to understand, okay? When you look, as a straight man, when you look at a woman, you don't go, you just like, oh, she's pretty. I'm attracted to her. You don't like, I bet you she has like a hole somewhere where I could stick my penis in. That's not what you think. Okay. That's not, I mean, if you think that, then I get, I don't want to shame your sex, whatever you have. Um, but that's not what you think. You just look at her like, why am I, I'm just such, wow, wow. I'm so attracted to this person. Wow. I can't help my attraction. That's what you think. You don't really like, hmm. Hmm, I wonder if she has the right genitals for my for my genitals. That's not what most people think, okay? <laughs> hey, Queen is saying they think homosexuals are effing horny animals. Wait a second, Queen. What's wrong with being horny? I mean... Okay, okay, okay. Are we are we horny shaming people? Because if homosexuals are not effing horny animals, I am. Are you are you horny shaming me now, Queen Febby? 
Okay, nothing from Matt. Let's just pretend. Hey, if you're homosexual, if you want to be horny, it's okay. Just be as horny as life is more interesting if you're horny. Did we already? Yeah, we already did this one. Okay, hold on. This is okay. This this guy looks like a professional. This is pathetic. On the flip side, I can sense the de desperation here to attack our faith and cause offense and the fear of Islam in the hearts of the faith. Oh, <laughs> come on. Look at this. It got 67 likes. They're like, oh, this is good news because they fear our religion. That's why they're making this. The disbelievers, they fear Islam and their desperate attempt to destroy Islam is only going to make us stronger. This gay movie is a, is a plot by the Illuminati and the Zionists and they're desperate because Islam is so strong and it's going to take over the world and they're just trying so hard to make gay movies to stop Islam. Wow, guys, they genuinely, like, you have no idea how sure they are that this is such a good take. The have seen the con that is happening here. We'll, so he continues. We'll continue to grow in number and strength. Such acts only make us pity and have sympathy for those on the other side. Yeah, sure, buddy. Sure, buddy. You're full of sympathy. You think you're under attack because a movie depicts gay Muslims. You think you're under attack. You think you're under attack because gay Muslims are being highlighted as a thing that is real. And then you call others desperate. The level of self-awareness is below zero. Below zero! Uh, da, da Vinci saying, I will wage war on everyone involved. Chill, dude. And he has a meme with the monkey with the sniper gun saying, all right, buddy, you better delete that right thing now before Furious George snipes your ASS. Okay. Ooh, look at this. Look, guys, they don't even... Look how bad it's getting. Bring back ISIS. Wait, what does this mean? As... could be even worse because i thought he meant like bring back you representing us as isis or is he just saying no just bring us the real isis so we could deal with this stuff if any of my mutuals agree with this i hope you burn in jahannam you dirty f-u-c-k wow so he's telling his friends that if you agree with this movie i hope you burn in hell jahannam is hell in Arabic. This one is saying, the directors and actors are asking to be, wow, wow, be he to have their heads separated from their shoulder at this point. Wow, great takes, great takes. Oh, not a great take, sorry. YouTube, don't be, don't be, don't be stupid. I'm not saying that, I'm not saying that, okay? And also subscribe to our newsletter because if we get removed, from all these uh, platforms at least we could reach out to you and guys by the way if you subscribe to our newsletter you get a free copy uh, why there's not where's your copy susanna get it get it get it they're doing promotion you get a free it's not even promotion it's free okay so if you subscribe to our newsletter link in the description you get a free copy of why there's no god ah Come on, like I'm handing it out for free. Okay, it's a bestseller on Amazon and you get it for free. So subscribe to our newsletter and you get a free copy of Why There's No God sent to you. Link in the description.